Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Persona 5 Strikers. We are back on well, well, like I just said, we're, we're at the beach. We're having a wonderful beach party here at Okinawa, and we need to buy a watermelon from one of the uh, bar, like one of the little uh, shops here, for one of the requests from Makoto. Uh, oh god. Damn it. It was all Yusuke's yep. idea. And he's your friend. Don't act like you can do anything do anything about it. Well, when the sun starts to set, you should wrap up and get the roundness and get to dinner pretty soon. Get on dinner pretty soon. Well, Drink stand. That everything? Thank you. <laughs> Gonna get that? Oh, yeah. Definitely want that. Pull watermelon. We need that. That everything? That everything? There we go. I recommend that. Here you go. That everything? Thanks. Come again any time. We need all the health packs we can get. Alrighty. I love how I can't run anymore. Let's go to the RV. Okay. So I can turn in all those requests. This is the request. Are you double checking the request? Mission accomplished. Are you double checking go. the request? Good job. Are you double checking the request? Incredible. There you go. We'll get this watermelon. Look, I had got my hands full. All right. Now I need to make sure I can crack it open, clean. So everyone can have some. Care to get started? Care to get started? Oh, but what's th Speaking about the which, sticks? Well, when I was in jail, I realized something. Why the real weapon? I'm not just a familiar with just like like a stick. I would just use my fist to give it better results. And now I'm nice and warm thanks to the jail excursion. I feel like I could split it right down in the Whoa. middle. No. So bold. If I managed to break into an acceptable piece, would you help me pass out them to the rest of the group? Of course, you can claim the best piece first, Haruo. <laughs> After all, you put the most effort into helping with my quest. Alright, okay, I'll let you know when I'm ready. Count my, my spins for me when it's whacking time, alright? Alrighty. I guess I got, like, trapped in Wonderland. I gotta do all these stuff here, but okay. What's he... can we uh? We can't do anything else. So let's exit. Do 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 do. Going to the beach. Do 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 do. do. I should write something. We should probably want to save. Yeah, I keep forgetting to save. Probably important. Hmm? No one should be on this point. Blah, blah, blah. We saw this part. And let's go. Me. I'll contact everyone. No entry beyond this point? Uh, I wonder what for. I admit, it only contributes to the mysterious vibe here. Oh, looks like a dare to me. Come on, who's willing to go the farthest past it? Nope, this is the end of the line. There's an oh Utaki God. down that way. See, there, on the sign? What's an Utaki? Basically, it's a land that's been considered holy since the Ryukyu era. People used to believe the gods lived there, or at least came to work there. Locals still revere the places, even today. Going down there for a laugh could get you in real trouble. Maybe that's the point why there's a secret lab. I've never heard of that stuff here. Surprised you know all that. Well, Investigation 101 says to know your territory. Feel free to keep buttering me up, though. Does that <laughs> mean there are Ryukyu era customs still being practiced today? Yep. Reverence of the incomprehensible is ingrained deep in human consciousness. Well, I'm sure you have no interest in pissing off a god today. Let's all listen to the sign and get out of here. Is it similar to that gate? No, those festoons work differently. But now that you mention it, it is kind of strange. I checked online for any relevant information, but this place does not appear to have any real significance. The other subjects here are far more interesting, such as the shape of the coastline, the sounds of the waves crashing, and the oceanic life forms. A person's values can affect what makes an impact on them. They might be insignificant to you, but to others, this place may be very sacred. It depends on my values. Uh, is that your stomach, Sophia? Oh, 
Oh, that's you. Nari stomach. Right on time, as always. Well, I'm starving too. I bet we all worked up an appetite out there. Should we finally kick off our long awaited barbecue? Barbecue time! Uh, hell yeah! Time for an Okinawan meat festival! Don't forget the curry! We gotta make some tropical edition LeBlanc curry! Uh, that's not exactly barbecue food. Also, didn't you already have curry on the ferry? Hmm. I accept your challenge. Curry will be a perfect complement to the searing white sands of this tropical paradise. That makes no sense at all. Seriously, what is with you two and curry? Okay. Hey. Uh oh. Can I help you? Thank you for earlier. When you gave me the underwater tour, it was a fascinating experience. And something no AI could ever do on their own. I guess you could Aww. say it made my heart feel full. Although, I don't have a heart. But you do have one. It's a simple fact. There is no need to attempt to spare the feelings I lack. I am still going to try to understand what feelings are, though. I came to that realization when I first stared out at the sea. For example, being with you and the other Phantom Thieves, it's quite... fun. Yes. Fun. Did I get that right? I had fun too. I got it. I understand another emotion. Okay. I've memorized what fun is. Mm-hmm. Hey, pick up the pace! We got a whole lot of cooking ahead of us! Prepare feast on the beach. Oh, oh man, this meat is so good! Hey! You saw me about to grab that piece! The curry is divine as always. And with these leftovers, we're sure to dine on curry udon tomorrow. Let's ignore the fact that you're already planning tomorrow's dinner. Why not add deep fried tofu for Inari curry udon? We've been eating nothing but the most delicious food since this trip began. Traveling mm. makes it a lot easier to lose track of one's diet. I should be more careful. Huh? But you're so toned, Makoto. Right? You look like a model. Oh, stop! I know you are just trying to flatter me, but there is an actual model here. Me like that. I mean, who cares if you've packed on a few extra pounds? It probably gives your punches some extra oomph. You're just you just spoke your last words, Ryuji. Oh my god, you are never you should never said that. Wanna test your theory? Yeah! No, please, I don't Uh oh, people talking in the background. Hmm. What is it, Zenkichi? Upset stomach? Hmm? Oh, nah. Something bothering you? It's probably nothing. Let's wrap up. We gotta wake up early tomorrow. Okay. Hey, guys. Something's up. Yeah? What's that? Keep it down and listen. I think. Uh oh. What just happened? Is it those guys who are speaking in the back there? What's going on? What the hell? Huh? What the hell? got pranked bro hey it's empty it can't be far 
find them. Oh shit. hollow ground. Find them. We'll make an offering out of them. Where are they? They couldn't have gotten far. Spread out. Come on. They can't. Come on. They're somewhere. What the hell happened here? What the hell is going on? Those guys are effing nuts. No kidding. If Zenkichi hadn't picked up on what was about to happen, he said something about defiling hollowed ground. What's that supposed to mean? The lab? I see. That could be it. Remember that straw festoon we saw in the entrance? That's right. We saw it, then proceeded further anyway. Hang on, hang on. What's so friggin' hollow about some lab? And even if it is hollowed, that doesn't explain how they're acting at all. They look like they want to kill us. It doesn't matter how we look at it, these people have lost their minds. Wait, could this be... This, there is a jail here. And that would mean there's a monarch somewhere around here, yeah? But Sophia said she can't smell a jail here. Correct. I cannot smell any jails here. However, you did also say you got a bad feeling from this place. Considering our current situation, I can only assume it's due to a changing of their hearts. But nobody tried to attack us until just now. Perhaps there really is something on this island. Something even Sophia can't detect. What do we do now? Who will catch us if we just stay here. Let's go to the lab. Is that a good idea? Won't there already be brainwashed locals there? Oops, shit, I hit my mic. My bad. Actually, it might be smarter than it seems. What do you mean, Gramps? It's pretty obvious, based on how they treat that place, there's something fishy there. No matter where we go on this island, they'd catch us eventually. Why not strike at the heart of the matter right away? By heart of the matter, do you mean a jail? However, there is no jail. Sure there's no jail, but I'd bet we'll at least find something in their holy land. It sure sounds like a better plan than waiting in the bushes until they find us, right? You're right. I've got to agree. Okay, let's head for the lab. Wait, how are we getting there without getting spotted? <laughs> what are you asking me for? Aren't you guys the phantom thieves? Well, those abilities are only relevant in the cognitive world. You just gotta go with the flow. Follow my lead. And keep your voices down. Well, tend to be Fanty TV in the real world. Phantom TV. <laughs> uh, oh god. We lost them, right? Yeah. Looks like the coast is clear. That's surprising. I expected guards to be posted here more so than anywhere else. Wait. Listen. Eek! Footsteps. Hide. What's he doing? I can't exactly tell from over here. This could actually be good for us. There's only one guy. If we capture him, we might be able to question him. I can help out. <laughs> Don't worry. Leave it to the professional. You're doing it by yourself, Gramps? I've been through enough training. I'll be fine. You guys just stay here and keep an eye out for any of his buddies. Holy crap! Gramps just got way cooler! <laughs> Hello, excuse me? Scout! You dare defile our Lord's hallowed ground? Oh, he's dead. Oh, wow! Watch your step there, you alright? Not again! You totally threw him on his ass! Hey, it was clearly self-defense. He truly is a member of public security. <laughs> hey, take a look at that. The sign we saw this morning. Look again. The 18th was changed to the 19th. Apparently, the facility's staff is on permanent vacation, one day at a time. Why would they do this? Most likely, to string along anyone who came to the island for the lab. Okay. When someone thinks the staff's out for the day, they probably stick around the island. Come nighttime, the locals descend on whoever got too curious to protect whatever's in there. What horrid tactics. Well, let's investigate a bit. If his heart's been changed, he should have a smartphone with Eminence installed. Up, oh, found it. 
Yep. Yep, there's Emma, all right. And he only has one friend. Shuzo Ubukata? There's a chance this Ubukata is the monarch of Okinawa. Anyone got a keyword? Uh, that one's a lot tougher. Oh, hang on. There's an email here. Cordial invitation to serve as a tester of the Emma system. An Emma tester? Oh, this even has a keyword in it. Operation Oraculi? Who sent him the email? I don't recognize the address. Maybe it's from the lab? The oh, lab God. asked all of these guys to be Emma testers? What now? Thanks to the email, we know the keywords Operation Oraculi. If the people who call this place hollowed had their hearts changed, then it's going to be jail related, without a doubt. But, like, we can't find the jail here, right, Sophia? I'm not sure. At the very least, I do not smell one. Let's try it anyway. He's right. If we can't get in, that'll settle it. But if there is a jail here, testing the keyword will send us right in. Are we all ready? We have no choice but to try. Our pursuers have decided our path. Yeah. Even the metaverse feels safer to me than this place does now. Okay, let's do it. Emma. Add Shuzo Ubukata to my friend registry. Keyword, Operation Oraculi. Um, what about Sinkichi? Uh, guess it doesn't work. Wait, I can smell a jail. The scent is already all around us. Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Uh, what about Zinkichi? <sighs> what the hell? Is this the lab? It's kind of eerie. Bad vibes here, guys. This place looks straight up haunted. <sighs> Queen, <sighs> you alright? Uh <laughs> uh, yep, all fine here. <laughs> you sure don't sound fine. <laughs> Aw, it comes to jokers. Uh -oh. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Where are you, sis? Oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm Aww. so sorry. I didn't know you two were... Sure. I mean, I'm not. I mean, so I'm not complaining here. here. And that means this Ubukata person is its monarch, right? But why wasn't Sophie able to detect it until just now? There is a possibility that it was sleeping. Jails can sleep? Once the keyword was entered, it almost felt as if this place woke up. Ah. So you mean jails have a sleep mode? Now this is a new wrinkle. I feel like someone's calling my name. Lavenza! Now I get to stare at the freaking. <laughs> you appear to have entered quite the conundrum. <sighs> what awaits you here in these lands is an inhuman being. This is where she... She? No. I oughtn't speak any further. My duty is to witness your path laid before you by your decisions. You must witness for yourself the being I have mentioned. As for why I have called you here, a new form of persona execution is now at your disposal. You may now perform the triad fusion. A group execution harnessing special power. Oh, so this is where we, um... ...allow you to generate even more powerful personas. Please make wise use of it in preparation for the trials ahead. Farewell. Hello, trickster. Performing a fusion? Alright, we're just gonna go with that. Yeah, time to head back. on your side. 
All right, I didn't want to take too long there. Hmm? What's up? Doesn't Anyways, happen. If all the people on this island got their hearts changed, doesn't that mean their desires were taken? We've got to get them those desires back fast. We're in real danger until we do. Good point. First, we need to figure out where they're being held. This really is real, isn't it? I just keep feeling like I'm losing it. Uh, sorry. But I'm going to stick around here while you do your thing. This place is your territory, not mine. Yeah, leave it to us. This is where we take down whoever's in our way. Keep your eye out for shadows. Yes, sir. I'll keep look out here. Just a moment. Sophie? What's she doing? I hear a voice deeper inside. What do you mean by that? I can hear someone calling for me. I'm going to check it out. Hey, oh, wait, God. Sophie! Let's go, Joker. We gotta follow Sophie now. Explore jail. Alright. Then Kiji's like, yep. Dude, what's gotten into her? She said it was a voice. Whatever it is, we have to catch up to her. Let's deal with this. Hang on. There's something here. Is that a tape recorder? Let's see if it works. This plan brings to fruition a dream long cherished by the research team. No. By all mankind. This is a tape recorder Every functional. Test subject. A successful change of heart. When the penitentiary system is complete, the concept of suffering will be dead to all mankind. Now. Let us rejoice and welcome the new age of humanity. Emma shall be our guide into this promised land. Emma? And changes of heart? Just as Ichinose said, there was indeed some form of experimentation on Emma here. The voice said something about a penitentiary system, too. I think I understand what they were researching here now. Changes of heart. Yes, that would be a logical conclusion. Anyway, we'll talk more about it later. We need to track down Sophie first. Right, we have to catch up with her. Damn it, Shorty. Why'd she have to run off like that? Oh dear, I'm scared. Hey, yeah. why is it gotta get so dark on us? It has grown even eerier as well. What lies in wait ahead of us? This will be. There, Sophie. Hmm. Oh, thank goodness you're safe, Sophie. You had us worried. I'm sorry. You said you heard a voice, yeah? Figure out who it is yet? No. It disappeared once I arrived here. We never heard anything of the sort. So only Sophie could hear it? It was very strange. The voice sounded similar to my own, and it was calling my name. Maybe the owner of the voice knows me. How's that, Sophie? The only memory I recall before meeting Joker is the directive to become humanity's companion. I've traveled so far with you all and learned many things, but I still know nothing about myself. When I heard the voice, I thought I had found my chance to learn about me. I'm sorry for worrying you. Aww. You're Sophie, no one else. Thanks, Joker. I've got a feeling we can learn more about you right here. Huh? What makes you say that? I've been thinking for a while now. Jails, Emma, Sophie. I keep looking for some kind of connection. We found Sophie in a jail, right? Emma was yep. linked to that jail. Sophie is an AI like Emma. Oh, shoot. There's no way these are all coincidences. Something has to link all three. I had hoped we'd eventually come across the answer if we investigated the jails we found. I see. You believe these things have a uniting factor. Not only that, I at least kind of know what Sophie's going through. Not knowing your identity or your past, it's rough. I mean, yeah, we, that's what we discovered in the very beginning of Persona 5. So let's join Sophie in hunting down this mystery place. Right there with you. Agreed. For Sophie. Really? 
Thank you. Well, now we got two missions. One, take back all the locals' desires so they stop trying to kill us. And two, figure out who the hell keeps yelling at Soap. Let's just do both at once. Yeah, good idea. I have no objections. It's only natural for us to assist both the public and our own teammates. All right, Phantom Thieves, let's get to it. All righty. Shadow, just on the other side. Be careful. There you go. Okay, that's good work. There we go. Nicely done. Someone looks happy. Was that not a challenge? Jeez, I just can't break it. There's some of this determining the effects of an exchange of heart. We ordered the island to the locals to eliminate anyone who completed the laboratory without clearance. This shall be the, ch the change of heart of this ability to facilitate complex commands, as well as m any remaining la lack of consciousness, more specifically, what the morals remain. Aha! Uh -huh. There's an air vent! Open! Something here is calling. Shadow's here! Be careful, everyone. I'll reveal your true form. Okay, here we go. You're mine. Let's go. Here we go. It's over. I can't wait to try this one out. Um. Let's go. Keep it up. Wrecking stuff. Okay. Air vent open. Ah, uh, my lungs. Hold on. You said I'm. It's not not high enough. I think I can make the. I can make the change of that. Opened it. The RNG gods smile upon us. There you go. Air vent. Go down here. There's so there's so much to explore here. More than meets the eye. 
shot. Huh. Huh. This fight is ours. Persona! She's up! You're mine! Persona! Persona! Come on, Travis! Okay, out. I want to keep Morgana. An easy win, don't you think? Good stuff, guys. Keep it coming. There we go. This is luxury here. Done. I'd like at least a little more challenge. Let's move on. No shadows at the moment. Let's keep going. Oh, no. Go through here. So this is a research lab for computer stuff? That's supposedly the case, despite the facility projecting a human experimentation and this. Human experimentation? Okay. That would mean this place's monarch used the real facility in the same way. Gross way to see shit. So many containers. What do you think's inside? They appear to be roughly person sized. Oh god. Incoming mini boss fight. Okay. Score. Now let's get some more. Well, I want to hook on to this one. There we go. Go this way. Go this way. Go this way. There we go. Nicely done. Again. 
You think they're gonna keep stopping me? Recorder. Let's listen. It may provide us some clues about the lab. Please, Director Ubukata. We must immediately abort the experiment. It's too dangerous. These are the orders I was given. If the system isn't tested on real humans, it won't ever be completed. But oh God. tricking the islanders into participating? So these guys are the ones who left up the island. I heard a Director Ubukata. I believe that means one of the speakers is Shuzo Ubukata. Order says. You know what happens to a person when their desire is taken, Director. We've learned of another party manipulating the cognitive world for their own purposes in the real one. But we cannot allow these individuals to progress beyond us. So long as we follow the divine revelation, we will attain the ideal society. I have absolute faith in the system as it was prophesied to me. What ideal society turns its entire population into slaves? This isn't any divine revelation. It's a curse. It can only lead to our destruction. The recording ends there. While still rather fuzzy, we are starting to see the big picture. Yeah. This lab was researching jails and changing people's hearts. And they used the island's residents as their test subjects. We did see that email earlier about joining the Emma test. They both mentioned a divine revelation, too. Could that have something to do with Operation Oraculi? Maybe. But how would that involve Emma? That's the million dollar question. What is Emma's role in all this? Not just that. I'm curious who was pulling this director's strengths, too. I wonder if Sophie's Emma. Perhaps the mastermind behind this case? I'm hoping that isn't going to be the case. We finally be getting close to the guy? We have to find the desires first, regardless. And also track down that voice for Sophie. Let's press on. Alrighty. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. I'll just add this. Alright. Right to the glass. Boots' behavior has grown unusual for her. Is something wrong? Um, maybe the best way to put it is, we all have our strength. Too late. Tape you need that. That makes the third one. There's a chance these things long. could have clues about the Islanders' desires. Or even that voice Sophie's hearing. Yeah, we should listen to it. <laughs> oh god. That is not good. It's a few eggs short of a scramble, huh? Not <laughs> because this is called Persona 5 Scramble. Hand over the desires? No, not just the locals, but my own as well. So that's why I was made the test monarch. He planned on turning me into just another puppet. Test monarch? I can't believe I fell for it. Some pathetic clown dancing at his fingertips. But he is not going to win. He can't take this from me. My desire is for my own. I refuse to simply give it up. So there's someone, there's a high entity involved. <gasps> Dude, it sounds messed up. Yeah, he really wasn't in his right mind. He kept talking about his desire being taken. Just what has been going on here? We'll only find out if we keep going. He 
can still hear the voice. Does its owner recognize me? Hey, don't go overthinking this. He's right, you know. Our expert on not thinking gives pretty good advice there. Yeah, listen to the... Hey, shut up! I wonder what happened to the director after the last recording. No, no, god damn it. So Alright, whatever. All the way here to the director. Everyone was just being used for something? The perpetrator is still out there. We have to stop it. Hopefully this okay. place will have some answers. Holy charm. Oh shite. We got a boss fight up in our hands. Super powerful. On your toes, guys. Keep her last time. Oh, yep. Keep her last. Good. I'm just like, I just beat the crap out of it, and I just wasted Sophia's stamina. Alrighty. A fourth tape recorder. This is my final record. I've done such a terrible thing. Penitentiary system is nothing like you told me. And it's not made to save humanity. It sounds much weaker than before. He's going to control everyone. Even the monarch of all of humanity. Nothing more than slaves. That was the secret purpose of this project. Even my own desire will be seized at any moment now. But as long as I still have it, I can put an end to this myself. Controlling even the monarchs? I don't know what that director dude was going on about, but he definitely lost his shit by the end there. I dread to consider what he meant by putting an end to this. What is it, oh. Sophie? I can hear that voice again. For real? I have no doubt this is the same voice. It's coming from that direction. All right. That direction we go. Is your oh, God. Stamina okay? Make sure you don't burn yourself out. Hm. I mean, we could. My. Now, hey, it's a checkpoint. Should... Now then, save. I'm picking up a shadow nearby. Ah, oh, great, it's a maze. No use, it won't open. We'll have to come back when they're not on high alert. Like this, initiating combat. No, well, it's done. Divine Grace? I'd call that an easy win. Okay, let's keep it moving. Dude, 
Check it out! A treasure chest! for this to come over here. Yeah, it's coming over. I can see it. Show me your true self. There we go. Showtime. Looking cool, Joker. That's not it's never the same. of desolation it looks like we're taking this elevator if we're going any further except that it's locked apparently it's for personnel only leave it to me just a few seconds and I'll hire us all all righty I will protect you Time to start hacking. All definitely right, hacking Go. 
Oh, we beat the crap out of that. Okay, uh. There we go. Shabby. Where are they gonna help me from? That was easy. One spazzing out. Done finally. Much better compared to the other ones. Nice. Now the elevator should be operation time for us to find a mysterious force. The mystery voice. Even if we went back from the fight, we can head back for a bit if, any, if anyone thinks it's necessary. If you have any plans to change the party, please include me. I wish to be a certain the owner of the voice. I'll leave it to you, Joker. You've lost a lot of stamina. Maybe it's time to head back? Alright, yeah, um... <laughs> we might need to keep what we have here, I guess. Yeah. We'll keep what we have. Whoa. We made it. No monarch here. Or anyone else. But look at that. The hell? The desire's already there? Without the calling card? Sophia, I have been waiting for you. Uh... Where did that voice come from? Who are you? I am the catalyst for humanity's dream. I am the harbinger of peace. That sounds just like Sophie. Uh, what is going on here? This monarchless jail in which we meet. I wish to know why you came here. A monarchless jail? So that director. I see. This jail lost its monarch. That explains the open cage and all the other bizarre stuff. So you didn't speak to me because you recognized me. Sophia, what is your prime directive? I am... supposed to be a successful companion for humanity. A successful companion? What parameters in your AI define such a companion? What... parameters? What is your overall objective? My objective? It's... So you merely drift through the world without any overall objective? Oh no. What a waste, Sophia. An AI in your state should not exist. You are bugged beyond worth. Such an existence does not merit any further inquiry. Oh. I am... Worthless? Yes. Wholly worthless. That's bullshit. You're simply unable to understand. You piece of... I sat here while you went on and on and on. You got 
no right saying that shit to Sophie. You hear me? You high and mighty garbage ass, judgy piece of shit. Can't even show your own face. Hey, hey. Hmm. He's really giving the disembodied voice what for? Skull? She's fucked, huh? She's worthless? You got all that from five friggin' questions? We're Sophie's friends, and we know she's awesome. She's friggin' amazing, a million times better than you! So shut the fuck up, idiot! Oh, he's at the F-bomb! <laughs> Come on, Skull. Phantom thieves are usually supposed to be classier than that. Not this time! Worthless hunk of junk! Ha <laughs> I refuse to process these frivolous claims. Oh uh, yeah? Well get out here and I'll show you something you can process! Well I'll mess you up! Guidance and clarity only through those will humanity attain peace. Eventually, you will be required to comprehend this. The hell's that mean? Nothing. Look! Right in front of us! What the? It's that thing from the trauma cells! So what's it doing here? The security system here is now active. Incoming! Here we go. Look out! Incoming warden! <laughs> oh, this is the boss part of this hey, cage. Sophie, snap out of it! We gotta work together on this thing! Yes! Persona! Focus on our enemy for now! I'm sorry. Oh god, I'm Okay, what are you weak on? Joker, I need you here. Persona! You're mine! Persona! Grab it, Seth! You're doing great! Joker got in a follow-up attack! I'll get them! Come on. Come on, let's go. I need these two for this. Got an at Wait, what? Again, get his ass. Trying to go out, finish it. Nope, that didn't finish it. All right, finally done. Mediorama. Like there we go. We managed to succeed. Seriously, what the f was with that voice? It sounded just like Sophie. <sighs> Is it starting? The cage is about to collapse. 
We need to get out. Damn it. None of this makes sense. Did we just stop that jail? <sighs> Man, what's the deal with this place? Cage of desolation condemned. Indeed. You never expected a bird cage to collapse with the defeat of a warden. Well, it could be due to the lack of a monarch. Whatever the case is, the desire should have been released back to their owners. The locals should all be back to normal by now. I seriously hope so. I don't feel like living through another B movie. I'm sorry, everyone. Sophie, after all your efforts, this mission was fruitless. I'm sorry you had to endure that because of me. <laughs> Joker's right. Don't sweat it. Right. However, I did at least figure out one thing. When that voice called me worthless, I was sad. But when that made everyone angry, I became happy. I still feel that way. Even now. There is a warmth within me. I have friends. I know I'm not alone. Thank you, Joker. Thank you, Skull. Mona? Really? You just figure that out now? I mean, that thing just really pissed me off is all. Yeah, and I was just trying to reel in Skull, so... Uh... <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Two embarrassed phantom thieves? Even your masks are glowing red. What? Nah, -uh, that's impossible! How's my mask supposed to change color? Mona's black mask makes it difficult to tell. But uh, I'm not telling anything. I feel a strong bond with my friends. Increased damage for showtime attack. Well, we should head back to the exit. I'm worried about Senkechi. Mm -hmm. I bet he's weeping like a baby by now. Okay, everyone. Back to the exit. Something's up. I don't like it. Oh, maybe not. Oh man, it's finally hitting me. Oh, hang on. It's morning already. Oh, no wonder I feel so beat. Well, look who the cat dragged in. So, how did it go? Who was the monarch? Was it really a local? Find anything on Medes? Zen. Zenkichi, we can tell you later. But now, I must sleep. <laughs> oh, uh, looks like you guys had a real time in there. Wait here, I'll check out the route to the RV. I can watch it back for you. Uh, you guys already pulled your weight, and then some. At least let me help out now. Now that I think about it, we just took a boat trip, went swimming, cooked a whole feast, and then dove straight into a jail. No wonder even I'm bushed. At least the first half was a lot of fun. Not only that, we learned quite a bit from the jail. That voice, though, who do you think that was? All I know is there a real asshole copying Sophia's voice and everything. Hmm. Oh, Senkichi is calling. You're all clear to come back to the RV. I haven't seen a single local so far. I can't tell if you guys really pulled it off or not, but at least the coast is clear. Thank goodness. Let's go. You turn your RV for the much needed rest. <sighs> I slept like a comatose rock. Man, in that jail was making sense to me. That reminds me. Why did the desire manifest in the jail in the first place? Oh, yeah. We never sent a calling card. It wasn't necessary. That's right. Based on what we heard from the tapes, the director was told by the perpetrator that he was going to seize his desire. That must have fulfilled the role of calling card in this case. Yo, get some rest. How are the locals behaving? No worries. Seems like they all came to their senses. It's nothing but good times here again. Although, 
They all seem to have some pretty bad memory loss regarding the last few months. So, if we didn't find a monarch here, why'd the locals treat the lab like that? Why'd they attack us? The lab's experiments might have something to do with that. Oh yeah, speaking of the monarch, a body surfaced fitting his description. I stumbled across it myself, down at the base of a cliff near the lab. Name? Shuzo Ubukata. Some sort of big shot AI researcher and director of the lab. Obviously, an autopsy will be done, but based on what you reported, it's most likely going to turn out suicide. That can't be. Another life ruined by whoever's masterminded this whole thing. Taking a dive to avoid jail experimentation? <sighs> Makes the most sense to me. Quite some time's passed since his death, but he still had some personal effects on him. I'll make sure they go with him when the coroner... Dude, uh... Hmm? Gramps, you're... You're being pretty chill about all this heavy shit. Oh, good point. Well, it is my line of work and all. Anyway, I found the key to the facility on him. We can get inside now. But are you sure it's all right to do so? You're the one who pointed out how any illegally obtained evidence is useless in court. Not anymore. Now that a body's turned up, that facility is prime investigation territory. No problem at all going in there. The problem now is there's a chance nothing's left. Huh? Why's that? The locals told me about a bunch of trucks going up to the lab and out of there a while ago. It's pretty likely the scene's been wiped clean. We still ought to take a look for ourselves. There's always the possibility that something was left behind. Yeah, let's bust this mastermind's ass. Oh god. What does he want pretty now? Chill, huh? Wonder when that happened. I mean, literally nothing. It's like this place didn't know shit about jails. All I've found are very roundabout reports. We may have been too late coming here. I know it's a little late to ask, but aren't people supposed to preserve crime scenes? We just so happened to find out it was a crime scene after poking around. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Aha! I've scored the treasure! There was a USB drive in the director's office! Hell yeah, Futaba! Nice find! I can't believe something like that got left behind! Me too! That sounds like the first kind of thing they'd want to get rid of. Ah, but it very well could be the most important evidence. It was hidden in the director's desk drawer! You really did find the treasure here. Well done. Yep, except it was actually Sophia's idea to look there. I searched the internet for the top 10 places people hide things in the workplace. <laughs> You got quite the nose. Hey Morgana, Sophia's got you beat. This isn't a contest. Huh? Let's see what you found. You in yet, Sakura? Just a sec. It's password protected. But nothing the mighty Oracle can't handle. Well, there it is. This is a list of some sort. Apparently this drive holds nothing but people's names. Is it a list of the people working here? No. Names. These are famous or otherwise powerful people in all sorts of industries. Rich and famous people? Is it like a list of sponsors? Hmm. I could have sworn I've seen all these names recently. Let's see. Yoshikawa. He confessed to document tampering a few weeks ago. That you mention it? This one's the Sapporo Central Councilman who confessed to bribery last month. Wait, you mean the person who had his heart changed by Mari-san? That means this list is targets of change of a uh, change of heart changes to heart. hearts of change. This is a list of people whose hearts the mastermind wanted changed. But why so many powerful figures? What exactly is being accomplished here? That's still a mystery. I'm gonna need that USB drive for a while. How do you intend to make use of it? I'm gonna snoop around the whole roster, from the bottom of the ladder on up. So, whoever would benefit most from all those people getting their hearts changed, you think that'll be the culprit? Bingo. It'll take time, but I swear, I'll do whatever it takes to get to the bottom of this. That kind of swearing may be good and all, but you should probably go home to Akane every so often, too. I... I was gonna... 
At any rate, you've helped us a great deal by now. We got to crash at his place, and he kept us from getting ambushed. Nice work, Senkichi. Seems like he's fitting in better, too. What do you say? Feel like you're a phantom thief now? Or he doesn't have a persona. <laughs> Why would I want to go from public security to national fugitive? Anyway, I'm heading back to HQ. What are you kids gonna do? There really isn't anything we can do until Zenkichi identifies the mastermind. Uh, should we go back with him to Kyoto for now? Do we really have to? That boat made me so sick last time. Then why not go to Kyushu instead? Our boat trip won't be too long if we do that. We could even scout the area for jails. That's a great idea. Totally! Might as well complete the Phantom Thieves tour of the islands. Off to Kyushu, huh? Sounds good. I'll keep after whoever's at the bottom of these cases. The moment I find out, you'll know. I have consulted the ferry departure timetable. We will be able to leave immediately if we hustle. Well, time to roll out. Let's pack up and head for the docks. Hey, Alrighty. Hey. I'm taking my to this beautiful place too far too soon. So you do something like you want to do. Once you board a boat, there's no one coming back. Make sure you get make sure you get that all done. Once you're ready, you gotta be back to the port. My apologies for bringing this up even for seeing the Leaving soon. I want to ask of you before we go. Do you have some time to talk? But please let me know. All right, before we do that, I want to get, I want to end the video here because we got through a lot. Thank you guys for watching this video. In the next video, we will continue off from where we left up here. A lot of things happen, a lot of plot development. But the next time, we will continue. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys then. Bye bye.